Today we're going to hit a key concept for all these new viewers at the channel and a good review for our channel veterans. It's the sun that controls the most drastic earth changes in the disaster cycle. We'll start here. It was actually only a few years ago that the solar Heinrich Bond cycle was discovered. The Bond, or Dansgaard Oeschger events, occur on millennial time scales and involve significant hydroclimate impacts. The Heinrich events follow a 6,000 year cycle and turn a rapid heating into cooling as melted ice chills and freshens the Earth's oceans. Just three years ago, scientists began recognizing that the sun's impact on the Earth was what was helping to trigger these major Earth change events. Now this was bolstered by the discovery that those same millennial and 6,000 year cycles are found in super flare activity from the sun. On top of the millennial scale super flaring that has been known about for years, they found that the biggest flares happen on 3,000 and 6,000 year cycles, with the biggest ones nearing X1000 in power. There are some studies suggesting the sun can go even bigger. But there's even more to the story of the 6,000 year cycle. This is the chart showing all the magnetic intensity of Earth's magnetosphere field over the Holocene. You can see that there is a fairly well agreed upon dip in the data about 6,000 years ago. This set the stage for two huge discoveries the last 18 months. They officially found that a geomagnetic excursion and weakening of Earth's protective field did in fact occur at that time, and to an extent that it officially qualifies as a minor excursion. Two excellent confirmations, and those confirmations of the event 6,000 years ago combined with the ongoing magnetic pole shift and weakening field now, further combined with the known excursions 12,000 years ago, 18,000 years ago, 24,000 years ago, and those even further back in time, showing that the Earth's magnetic field is on a similar 6,000 year cycle, each taking a Heinrich-like event and implying that the solar Heinrich bond cycle is a magnetic one as well. Now there is highly detailed information listed in the resources below the video, but for now, the key takeaway is that the solar super flare cycle is the same exact cycle as the millennial hydroclimate events like the Green Saharan periods, monsoon collapses, and more, and the longer 6,000 year super flare cycle causes the Heinrich events, the biggest rapid cooling events of Earth, along with the geomagnetic excursion cycle. The last major Heinrich-like hydroclimate event was 6,000 years ago with the greenest of the green Saharan periods. The last geomagnetic excursion happened at that time as well. The cycle is due again now, 6,000 years later. The magnetic field is changing rapidly, and it's speeding up. And the melting polar ice is currently freshening the oceans once again as the Atlantic meridional overturning circulation is ready to collapse, which scientists have been discussing a great deal the last several months. This disaster cycle is a key facet of this channel. We discuss it regularly. Be sure to check out those resources listed below the video as we are not only due for this cycle once again, but whether we look to the oceans, the atmosphere, the polar ice, or geomagnetism, it's happening again right now. See you in the morning for The Daily Show. Be safe, everyone.